Falcon playing Rainbow Six Three Athena Sword, the expansion to Rainbow Six Three Raven Shield. This is my video walkthrough for the expansion. We're on mission five, which is Operation Proud Flag. Only four more missions to go. We're at the halfway point. It's uh, going pretty well so far. One dead, a couple wounded, but we'll survive. Okay, so this mission is um, we have to rescue a guy named Bagatini. That's all we have to do is just one hostage to rescue. The problem is the area. It's scary. There's just crap everywhere. Luckily, the hostage is in a very specific area. Um, wherever he is, there he is. He's right there. But um, this one gets sticky. I'll wind up controlling a couple different teams probably for this one. Hopefully I won't have to, but uh, unlike usual, I will actually be controlling the red team this time. They have the hardest objectives, and in this particular stage, um, trust me, there are just enemies everywhere, and I don't trust the computer as well as I trust myself. Again, I said computer, the AI. I don't trust the AI as much as I trust myself. So we will have three teams. Um, a sniper team, a covering team, and the main firing team. The main firing team will be red, actually... Let's mark the starting go codes. Green will come down here, wait at the top of the stairs, and wait for Alpha. Gold will come here, wait at these top of the stairs. Why does the waypoint act up like a stupid piece of crap? Let's just stick it there anyway. We're gonna wait for Alpha here. And red team, me. We'll be coming along here, and once again, we're going to be abusing the hell out of smoke grenades. So we're going to smoke this door, we're going to go door, to door, to door. Now here we have to go down the stairs. Oh, no, it's there we have to go down the stairs. Yeah, all right, there we go. All right, right. Um, wait, did I do something wrong? I think I did something wrong. Hold on a minute. Let me think. Oh, no, 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 no. This is correct. Okay, so. Yeah, these are downstairs, and this is kind of the scary... This is the scariest room here. So we're going to... Smoke the stairs. Go to the door. Go to these stairs. Now, this dude right here with the axe... There's actually a terrorist here, and he's a very good sniper who has overwatch on this entire courtyard area. Right here, I'm going to zoom the map out a little bit. This entire, now you can see the hostages in this building, and here's the extraction zone. So you have to walk through this very scary, huge open area with tons of baddies just everywhere. Huge sniper lines. And uh, the best thing you can do at the start is to make sure the sniper who has overwatch is gone. So at the top of the stairs, we smoke the door. We come in and we just kill just everybody. It's going to get ugly. We go to the top of the stairs here. We go downstairs. We're going to go to this door. Now this main area should be clear at this point. There will be a couple areas that are not, but we're going to have um, the other teams deal with him. And we just walked out this door, there's a sniper in this building who would kill us. So we're not going to let him have that chance. So here... Uh, why are you doing this to me? Stupid... Waypoint system. Right click. Oops. I don't know why my waypoint system's so glitchy today. Smoke here. And we come up and we wait for Bravo. Now, let me see. At some point... Okay. At this point, we're going to call Alpha. So on Alpha, Gold... is Their entire mission is basically to haul ass right here and snipe until Charlie. That's it. That is their only mission as fast as they can possibly go. Green, meanwhile, on Alpha. This area will be clear, as will most of this. Um, I need to look around real quick because I forget my marks for a second, and I apologize for that. Um, 
Right. Okay. So, I got it. Green, at this point, will come into this room and go door to door to door to stairway to door to door to door and hold for Bravo. On Bravo. They will come in, they will smoke. You know what, I just realized I'm leaving this entire thing open. Um, actually that kind of works. Okay, on Bravo, they will smoke the door, exit the door, they will come back around and clear this area door to door to door. And then they will come back and they will come here and they will snipe for Charlie even as uh, Gold is doing. They won't have a sniper rifle, but they'll just snipe with their rifles, their normal rifles, or even their SMGs, um, just to give uh, Red a little bit more room. Yeah. Okay, and then Red on Bravo is going to stick to the wall as much as possible, and they're going to come up. They'll basically be following Green when they make this move. And then they're going to come up. There's a couple ways to do this. I'm gonna, I've never taken this path before, and I want to see if it's easier. I think it is, and I'll tell you why. Normally I come in this side door, but the problem here is not only this terrace, but you walk out into this hallway, and this entire courtyard can see you here. And I don't like that. So, Red will come down here, smoke this door, to door, here they will smoke here, they will head upstairs, get the hostage. Once they have the hostage, then they will come through this door, and once we get past this little point right there, we are going to haul ass to the extraction zone. Notice that uh, green and gold do not break from Charlie sniping, they will just snipe and snipe and snipe until we are safe. Whew, okay, that should do it. All right, red team is very, has a very dangerous uh, set of things that they have to deal with. They will have Ding, Daniel, Santiago, and Walter. Green team will have the recon specialist. Maldini is hurt, so they'll be led by Sue, whoops, I didn't hope we get on there. Be led by Sue on pack and Tracy Wu. And the gold team will have the snipers. Kire is dead and Homer is injured, so they will be led by Emilio Nar Narano and Einar Peterson? I think that's his name. So that's what we're doing. Okay, the red team. Because I'll be doing a mix of long range and short range shooting, I'll be taking my favorite G36K with suppressor, 92FS. We're gonna have a uh, Euro camo medium, because it's gonna get sticky and smokes right green team will be doing you know i guess they're doing mostly well they are gonna have to do some long range shooting i'm gonna let them have the uh i'm just gonna give let them ha keep the same equipment that'll be good and then gold team will have the covert no actually because the gold team will not be using thermals i'll use a different sniper rifle we'll give them the dragonov suppressed there we go. Yes, okay, last check on equipment. That should be good. I'm gonna go ahead and save this plan as Pyro Mission 5. And hopefully this will work out for us. Stay tuned, guys.